To begin assembly of the AMS gas vapor probe system, remove the rotary hammer from its case. Insert the extension drive adapter into the hammer, making sure it's properly seated. The hammer drive adapter is inserted slot downward into the hammer's chuck. Then pull and turn the locking pin to seat the adapter in place. Before operating, check to see that the adapter is properly installed. Next, attach the 5 8 inch tile probe base section included in your kit to the extension drive adapter. Securely tighten the fitting. It's important throughout assembly that all fittings be tightened securely. This will substantially reduce stripping of your threads during operation. Next, fit the electric rotary hammer into the extension drive adapter. Apply pressure downward and begin your hammering operation. If you're working in a remote site where power is unavailable, replace the electric rotary hammer with the AMS slide hammer included in your kit. To do this, simply attach the slide hammer adapter to the extension and place the slide hammer in the adapter. When the top of the tile probe base extension is approximately six inches from ground level, remove the hammer from the extension drive adapter and the adapter from the tile probe base section. Attach an extension section to the tile probe base using the provided coupling and tighten securely. Refit the extension drive adapter to the extension making sure all fittings are tight. Resume operation and repeat this procedure until your required depth is reached. Once desired depth is reached, remove the tile probe and extensions. To do this, Fit the special GVP removal jack onto the exposed extensions below the drive adapter or extension coupling. Simply remove the extensions and base section from the soil using the jack. You now have a clean pilot hole in which to install the AMS retracted tip or dedicated points. Now disassemble all extensions and remove the tile probe extensions from the drive head. If you have ordered a flight it auger and extensions with your kit, it may be easier to auger a pilot hole with the flight it auger under some soil conditions. It's your call. Flight it augers and flight it auger kits are available by calling AMS at one of its distributors. Remember, it's not always necessary to make a pilot hole before installing the dedicated tips or sampling with the retracted tip. If you know the makeup of soil in your sample area and are confident that rocks and other solid obstructions will not be encountered, then the hardened stainless steel tips of both instruments will easily penetrate to the depth you require. Cut a length of Teflon tubing supplied with all AMS kits at least six inches longer than the total length of the extensions you're using. Attach the retracted tip to the tubing by slipping the tubing over the barbed tang on the retracted tip. Insert the other end of the Teflon tubing into one length of the gas vapor probe extension. When the retracted tip meets the other end of the extension, tighten the tip onto the extension. Thread the Teflon tubing through the extension drive adapter and tighten it onto the extension. Now you can carefully place the retracted tip assembly into the pilot hole, attach the rotary hammer, and drive within six or so inches of ground level. The extension drive adapter can now be removed in a second extension threaded onto the Teflon tubing. The extension is now attached to the one already in the ground. Be careful not to damage the tubing when threading it into the extension. As with all steps in installing the AMS gas vapor probe system, take care to fasten all fittings securely to avoid damage to your equipment. Now, thread the tubing through the extension drive adapter and attach the adapter to the new extension.
Test each joint for tightness and proceed to hammer as before, driving the retracted tip to your required depth. The next step is very important to the success of your sampling procedure. With a firm grip on the extension drive adapter, pull upwards at least two inches. You'll feel the retracted tip open. Leave it in the open position. You can use the jack to open the retracted tip under certain conditions. Remember to leave six to eight inches clearance between the adapter and ground level to accommodate the jack foot. Now attach the hand-operated vacuum pump included in the kit and evacuate ambient air in the Teflon tubing. Your vapor sample can now be taken with the equipment of your choice. When analysis is complete, you can remove the retracted tip with the assistance of the removal jack. Before using the versatile AMS patented retracted tip in a second location, it should be completely clean. Instructions for disassembly of the retracted tip for cleaning and decontamination are at the end of this tape. Your next step is to disassemble all extensions and remove the extension drive adapter. You're now ready to install the patented AMS dedicated gas paper points. To assemble each dedicated tip, push the Teflon umbrella over the barbed tang as shown. Next, slip the Teflon tubing onto the barbed tang. Attach the dedicated tip drive end to one of the extensions making sure the fitting is secure. Thread the Teflon vapor tubing through the tip drive end and the extension until the dedicated tip is a few inches from the drive end. Note, the Teflon umbrella has slits cut in it, allowing the umbrella to fold up for insertion into the tip drive end. Place the assembly in the pre-drilled hole. Attach the hammer drill and drive as before. Adding extensions until your required depth is reached. When the dedicated tip reaches your required depth, remove the extensions and tip drive adapter from the hole, leaving only the dedicated tip with its umbrella and Teflon tubing in the ground. The tubing can now be terminated and finished off at ground level according to your individual testing requirements. You can also take soil samples at various depths with the new AMS 5 8 inch soil probe, sold as an option with this probe kit. Soil samples can be taken easily with this probe. To disassemble the AMS retracted tip for cleaning, start by removing the barbed insert from the outer sleeve. Then remove the outer sleeve from the bottom nut and then the inner nut can be removed from the vapor inlet shaft and the bottom nut and screen can be removed. To reassemble the AMS retracted tip, replace the screen over the vapor inlet shaft. Then put the bottom nut over the screen and thread the inner nut into place. Next, place the outer sleeve over the vapor inlet shaft assembly and thread tightly to the bottom nut. Finally, install the barbed insert into the outer sleeve. The tip is made of high quality heat treated stainless steel and is machined to strict tolerances assuring the tip opens easily and completely time after time. The AMS retracted tip has been tested to depths to 20 feet and greater. The AMS retracted tip along with the AMS Deluxe Gas Vapor Probe Kit is by far the best soil gas sampling kit on the market today. When you use them in conjunction with each other, all your bases are covered when trying to detect a possible leak present in the soil. Both the AMS retracted tip and the AMS gas vapor probe system can be used in a variety of applications. They can be used where and when any soil gas survey needs to be taken, ranging from locations at landfills to surveys for real estate transactions, along pipelines for taking samples in areas with shallow water tables, for more information on the AMS retracted tip, the AMS gas vapor probe system, or any AMS soil or groundwater sampling product, please call or write AMS or one of its distributors.